Hi, Libra, Narai here. Thank you for watching. I am gonna do a reading for you guys. If you're new to my channel, welcome, welcome, welcome. If you're returning, welcome back. My name is Narai, I go by Nay, and I'm going to pull tarot, oracle cards, and a few charms for you. This is for Libra Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and North Node, and South Node, any Libra placements, to be honest with you. This is going to be a rather quick reading. I hope you guys are amazing. I am trying to grow my channel, so if you haven't already, hit that subscribe bell, a uh, button, and that notification bell to be notified the next time I make a video. I do uh, short three minute or less videos on my channel now for all signs, so if you're pressed for time, that will be specifically for you. And um, yeah, so let's get this started. Messages and guidance spirit for Gemini. Ooh, I said Gemini. I just did Gemini. Maybe somebody's dealing with a Gemini. This is for Libra. This one. Oh no, I see disappointment and regret with the Five of Cups. Somebody may be needing to forgive or ask for forgiveness. I have, oof. Yeah, it's like crying over spilt milk. But I have the two of pentacles. This is you guys making a decision and balancing things out, prioritizing, figuring out what is important in your life. Um, what's at the bottom of the deck? Bottom of the deck. I feel like that needs to be at the bottom. Okay. Bottom of the deck, um, I'll be reading that one last. So I have the two of pentacles. I feel like you guys are trying to balance things in regards to your emotions because of the fact that this came out, the five of cups. Um, I feel like some of you feel really disappointed in the fact that something didn't work out. Um, maybe there was some bad news that was received in regards to something and so you're very disappointed. But I have, um, I feel like you guys are making the necessary changes to adjust and prioritize and, and get yourself back together. I feel like some of you feel kind of like um, you lost a little bit of control. Um, but this is you guys, this is about you guys not taking things so seriously and um, making time for yourself to nurture your inner child and have fun and kind of get out of your head. I have the Queen of um, the Queen of Swords because this is the type of energy that you guys are in right now. You're in that energy where it's like, okay, excuse me, okay, uh, Libra has been through a lot. In labor, you're kind of like, I, I'm going to put my boundaries down. I'm going to speak my mind if something bothers me, which is perfectly fine. But have fun too. Don't be so serious all the time. I know some of you can kind of like snap. So it's like, have some humor in regards to certain situations where um, it may be appropriate and don't take things so seriously and nurture your inner child. Uh, yeah. So, something or someone is coming towards you um, pretty fast. It could be, for some of you, it could be this disappointment. You may not see it coming. Um, but I have that somebody's gonna come towards you guys too. You might, I feel like you're gonna receive a message from someone because I pulled the page of earth too. And I feel like this person is kinda like really wanting to come in fast, but they're kinda like, I might need to take some time. I don't know how I'm gonna do this. I say that with the flowers. Or it could be somebody's coming towards you with an apology for this. And this is why forgiveness is on the card. But I feel like there's going to be some sort of communication and it could actually be um, via text message or email. I feel like you guys are going to be in the energy where you're kind of like holding back and not putting all of yourself into the situation or not giving all of your energy. Definitely not reacting. Whew. Look up angel number 444. And then for some of you, 
I feel that um, this is in regards to you not emotionally spending money to feel better. Go for a walk. Save your money. You, your money needs to be saved for something. Messages and guidance. I'm going to say this because I woke up this morning, and I don't know why I didn't say this on my other readings, but I'm saying it on yours today because you're the third one I'm doing. Um, I, I had a dream, and I know it wasn't my dream. It was in regards to tarot. So somebody lost a, a white bracelet or something um, because in my dream I saw that somebody stood up and it like fell on the side of a cushion on a couch so that's for someone or there's something you wear on your arm that's in a cushion on a couch um i i feel like it could be um possibly a ribbon from somebody that has passed or something like that i don't know why but yeah, wanted to say that. And then there might be some Libras that need to actually fast. I woke up this morning and there was um, a voice in my head that said, you don't need to eat any food today. You can only drink coffee and water. So I am drinking iced coffee that I made myself with sugar-free creamer, very minimal. And I have to drink this three times. Fill it up three times before this day is over. So that is for somebody that's trying to feel better and be on some sort of health journey. I needed to say that. So here's the moon card I got for you, Libra. It says the answers you need are coming. Some of the answers you might be looking for might be coming with the message and this person coming towards you possibly. So let's go ahead and pull you some charming charms. And I know this wasn't a long video. I'm trying to work on making my videos a little shorter so I can actually have more content to put out to everyone. And I'm gonna use my hands and this is kind of noisy. I normally use this, but I'm not wanting to pull as many charms. What messages do we have for Libra? Okay. Oh no, you guys too? I pulled four. Something's telling me to get two more. What is that? Oh yes. Okay, got you. Alright, so the first thing I have is a clam. And this is either about you guys not clamming up when it comes to communicating or you guys needing to go to the beach to get grounded. It's a clamshell. Um, the next thing I have is confirmation that you're gonna get a message because I have a bird. You may hear some gossip, don't gossip. So here is a bird charm. Uh, the next thing I have is well, a rocking horse. I got this for Capricorn too. Um, if you're somebody's pregnant or somebody can possibly get pregnant or impregnate, so if you don't want that, be safe. Strap it up, buttercup. Um, I have the peace symbol because you are going to protect your peace. That is why I pulled the four of sword, uh, four of pentacles. It's about you protecting your energy and your peace. You're not going to allow anybody to come in and take away from that. And then I have Saturn, my planet. And I am a Libra moon, by the way. Um, Saturn is the planet of lessons. This is about learning the lessons and the situations that you've experienced. Like look at it from the outside and see what you could have done differently and what the possible lesson was for you. And also Saturn is in retrograde right now until October. And so karma is going to be very strong for people. So be mindful of your words and your actions so that they don't come back to bite you in the butt later or next lifetime. And then the last charm I have is lipstick. This is 
confirmation of the gossip. Um, don't gossip. Watch the words that are coming off of your lips and out of your mouth. And also, some of you um, may not be feeling well, ladies. And this is just a reminder that it's the smallest thing that we do. Like, I put on um, lip gloss when I'm not feeling well. I feel well today, but I wear lip gloss normally. But putting on lip gloss or lipstick sometimes, if we look better, we feel better. That's what that's about. So that is what I have for you guys, Libra. I hope you enjoyed the reading. I love you guys. Please like, share, and subscribe. Bye.